Hello everyone and welcome back in the TSG today. We're continuing this goalkeeper career mode and we're getting very, very close to the end of the season. Eight games remain, seven in the league and one cup final. So today we're going to be playing these four games against Lazio, Verona, Bologna and Cagliari. And then we'll be playing these last four matches with a Roma in the final of the Coppa Italia. And then our last game of the season will be against Sampdoria. So... We've got a lot to come in a short space of time. We're going to do it over two episodes. We're going to do four games this episode, four games next episode. We're one point behind Inter Milan. It's probably the most important run of games we've had in this goalkeeper career mode yet. We could potentially be winning a league title if we can just keep winning games and keep staying as close as possible to Inter Milan and hope they slip up. But Lazio is probably one of our toughest games left of the season they're currently in seventh we're away to them let's get the three points come on right one of the most important games they're left of the season come on Ronaldo come on Lucas Mori let's get the job done nice Artur lays in Lucas Mora Lucas Mora good save from the keeper there could have been 1-0 just 10 minutes into the game we started well oh no no he's gone over the top get there I don't know why he didn't pass that across the floor. If he passed that across the floor, he would have had a clear shot on goal. Maybe he would have saved it. Maybe he would have scored. But, I mean, the fact he put it in the air gave us a chance to come and get that. Escalante. Over the top. Oh, they like putting it in the air, don't they? He's falling to him, though. And what a finish, Mariki. Oh, that was right in the corner. Oh, slow start from us. We've had one chance and then kind of not attacked since. It's been all... Lazio, Gordon, I don't think there was much we could do about that one. Look, he puts it in the air. It falls perfectly for Mariki. And that is right in the bottom corner. If you look at where this actually went in the goal. Look at that. All right, 1-0 down there. We need to get back into this game as soon as possible. That's his 13th of the season. Nice. Neves, slip him in. Yes, Lucas Moura put this one away. He does. 32nd minute, 1-0. We're back in the game. Lucas Moura scores this chance. Look, it's a great little pass through to him here. One touch and bang. We'll take it. Right, we're back in the game. Lucas Moura has now scored seven goals this season. Still got it. Nice. Morata. One last chance before half time, maybe. Morata, pass it. Ronaldo, slip him in. Benedeschi. Lucas Moura. Yes! We scored in stoppage time of the first half. We're 2-1 up. This is perfect. A bit like, um, I can't remember what game it was last episode. We went 1-0 down early on and then got ourselves back in the game pretty quickly. That's another good finish from Lucas Moura. He's been playing like right midfield most of the season. But the last couple of games, they put him in at striker. Um, and he scored. Fair play to him. Half time, 2-1 up. We just need to keep what we got now. Yes, Gordon. Lucas Moura. Go on. Get on that. Lucas Moura win it. He heads it down. Ronaldo. Oh, he can't get our third. If we get a two-goal lead, I think it'll be game over. 15 minutes to go to hold on to the, the lead and get the three points. Benedeschi. Lucas Moura. Yes. Hat-trick for Lucas Moura. It's game over. We get the three points. I think. There is 14 minutes. That might have been a bold statement, but I think we've done enough now. Lucas Moura, what a legend. We needed someone to step up this game, and he did. That is a great finish again. Maybe a bit closer to the keeper's hand. He maybe almost got that. Oh, he's not far away. But still, great finish, great hat trick. What a player. Artur, Ronaldo. Lucas Moura, Ronaldo, oh great turn, shoots, an easy enough save for Strakosha, I think that's how you say it, the Lazio keeper. Full time then, we went 1-0 down, we didn't get the clean sheet, but we got back into the game, we won 3-1, we got the three points, Lucas Moura, definitely man of the match for that game, what a performance. So with that win, Inter Milan also won, we're still one point behind them. As you probably saw from the title, it's decision time again. I've got kind of 
three scenarios to choose from or three things that we can do that I need you to let me know in the comments what you prefer to see. So just, the option one is we stay at Juventus for another season. Um, but option two is we stick with Gordon, we move to the Premier League. I think the Premier League is going to be the most competitive league for Gordon at this point. We move to a Premier League side, uh, see what we can do over there and challenge ourselves a bit more. Because um, I think that'll be much more competitive instead of just us and Inter, like two teams going for the title. I think there'll be maybe even six, maybe to eight teams that uh, are fighting for top four places. So I think that would definitely be more competitive. We'll face more shots. We'll probably have some more entertaining videos. Let me know if you want to see that. Or option three is now I've got a feel for the goalkeeper career mode. Now I've got a feel for playing as a goalkeeper on FIFA 21. We start fresh. I have a couple of ideas. Maybe do like a storyline goalkeeper career mode. We start again. And instead of like Gordon, I think he's 19 or 20. He's 88 rated because I've done training every week. Um, I limit it to one or two training sessions per month. And then he won't reach 88 till maybe three or four years. So we have a slower or like a slower development. So first season, we'll probably start at a lower club. Second season, we might still have to stay at a lowish club. And then third season, we maybe break into a top division. And there you go. So it drags it out a bit more. Instead of going straight from, um, what was it? Huddersfield, Watford in one season and then straight to Juventus. You know what I mean? So we do a career mode like that with a storyline. I've got a couple of ideas. Let me know if you do want to see that. So they're the three options. Comment them below. And obviously, whatever's the most popular, whatever people want to see is what I'll do. We do also still obviously have another couple of episodes left of this career mode. And we are fighting for two trophies with Mr. Gordon Southern. We have the league and the Coppa Italia. Anyway, into this game against Verona then. We are away. They are down in 18th. This should be a pretty straightforward game, but we know it's never quite that easy. I'll tell you what, for a team that's struggling down the bottom, they're really going for it. That's quite an attacking formation. Great ball. Lucas Mora. Good feet. Ronaldo, put him in. Lucas Mora, he's on fire. What a finish that is. We're 1-0 up, 13 minutes in. Oh, happy days. Remember, we need to win this game. They are 18th. We need to make sure we get the three points. This was a lovely pass from Ronaldo. One touch, bang. No keepers saving that. Lucas Moura on the form of his life. So a fourth option is we keep this goalkeeper career mode, but we start a new player career mode as a striker or something and do a storyline or a new player career mode that way. Um, and I add that to the channel, but we still keep this Gordon Southern one going. Um, so yeah, let me know if you want me to do that instead. And if you do, make sure if you've already commented, you edit your comment and let me know that you'd actually prefer um, option four. Jensen, don't let him shoot. Lays it inside, shoots. And what a strike that is. That is so lucky. We were beat there. That was past us. Look, if that flies into that top corner, that is one of the best goals we conceded all season. But luckily, it hits the bar and goes over. We're still 1-0 up. Verona looking a bit more dangerous, though, than I thought they would be. Half-time then, 1-0 up. Playing pretty well. But Verona had a big chance. Well, it wasn't really even a good chance. He just put such a lovely stroke on it. It almost went in. But they're definitely looking a bit more dangerous. Remember, I'm planning through December to stream quite a bit or as much as I possibly can. I am getting a schedule out very, very soon. Um, so go check out my Twitch, twitch.tv forward slash 30sgpays. Junosovic, Radonjic, if he lays this off, it could be dangerous and it is. It's 1-0, 56th minute. Oh no, Verona back in the game, it's we can't afford to drop points against these. They're down in 18th. We've got to make sure this is a win. Look how easy that is. Lays it across and he's so close. We just had to hope that ball was smashed against us. But it's just gone to our left. We can't save that. A big half an hour left to get back in front here. Five minutes to go. We need this winner. Chankalai's in. Shoot. Oh my God. Lay it off. Yes. No. Nobody could get on the end of it. Oh, that should have been it. 
full time then 1-0 I can't believe we dropped points today against Verona and I can't believe that attack at the end Chankalai put it across goal it looked like it was on a plate for whoever that was who slid in but he couldn't reach it it's a shame we beat Lazio with a real good win and then go and lose uh, not lose but draw to Verona it feels like a loss Good news, Jesus has finally recovered from his uh, injury, so he can start playing again now. As you can see, Inter did win their game, so the three-point gap with five games left. Oh, there's a lot to play for. Anyway, we're home to Bologna. We have to bounce back with a win. They're 16th at the moment. We're home as well. We've got to win it. Kick off then. Come on! Don't take it short. Don't take it short. Don't. Okay, he's taking it short. Ronaldo, go on. Yes, Lucas Moura. Oh, what a save. Bernadeschi. Cleared. That was a big chance there to go 1-0 up. Morata. Bernadeschi. Ronaldo. Lucas Moura. Yes, that's five goals this episode for him. Every goal we've scored has been by Lucas Moura. Five goals in three games so far. Again, Ronaldo with the assist. No, it's just a little ball through to him. Easy finish. We're 1-0 up. Nice. Turn. Lucas Moura. Yes. He actually can't stop scoring. I don't know what it is. It's six goals in three games. He's the only bloke who seems to be able to score. But it's okay. Wow. We're 2-0 up in this game. This time I think it's Morata with the assist. Lays it off to him. Turns and shoots. Look, too powerful for the keeper. Half time, 2 0 up. Perfect response after drawing that last game. Can't, boys. Kingsley. Surely not. Surely not. Yes, we're quick off the line. Come and get that one. Artur. Lucas Mora for another hat trick. Go alone. He's played it to Ronaldo. Square it. Oh, I think he should have passed that across goal. I mean, it's great defending because I'm not sure if that was going in anyway. Let's have a look. Oh, I think surely the goalkeeper's saving that. I think it was Morata in loads of space at the back post, but we know what happened last episode when Morata had an easy chance. Ronaldo. Lucas Mora. Ronaldo. Oh, what a save. It just seems to be nobody can score except from Lucas Mora this episode. Look, Ronaldo just can't seem to beat the keepers. Full time then, we win 2-0. Perfect game. And actually, like our first clean sheet for a little while. Uh, we've let in a couple of goals recently, but a clean sheet today. Perfect. Inter Milan keep winning. We're still three points behind them. We've got Cagliari today in our last game of this episode. And then we'll have three league games next episode, plus a cup final to see our fate, see if we win a trophy, see if we do anything with this season really in terms of um, the league as well. Anyway, we're away to Cagliari, they're ninth. This probably isn't going to be the easiest game ever. Let's see how we get on. Right, let's end the episode on a high with a win and gives us a chance of fighting for that title or being ready if Inter Milan drop points. Let's see if anyone else other than Lucas Moura can score as well. Lucas Mora puts him in. Bernadeschi, lay it back. Ronaldo, yes. We're 1-0 up. I thought we'd missed the chance when Bernadeschi missed there. But he done well to get the assist. Lay it back. Ronaldo scores. 1-0 up. No. Mateus lays him in. Shoots. Good save, Gordon. And it's cleared. Oh, we saved it with our legs. That almost went through our legs. Oh, we kept it out, though. Still 1-0. Half time, then. We're 1-0 up and finally someone other than Lucas Moura has scored. Cristiano Ronaldo back in the goals. Pavoletti. Oh, it's a great header across goal. Good clearance, Chiellini. That almost was a chance for them out of nothing. Great ball, Neves. What a pass. Chankalai, so much space and time. Shoots. And good save. I mean, he probably should have passed that, let's be honest. That could have sealed the game. Hopefully they don't counter-attack us now. Full time. It was not easy that game. We managed to get the 1-0 win. Another clean sheet which was good. 
and another three points. Inter Milan won again, so it's going to be a real interesting last three games of the season. We just got to hope somebody beats them or two people draw against them or something that's going to give us a chance back in winning this title. Remember, options are for these decisions. I need your help. Option one, we stay at Juventus, stay with Gordon in this career mode, uh, play a career mode for next season as well. Option two um, is we move to the Premier League or move to... I think the La Liga or the Premier League is the two that will be competitive and make it more interesting as we go through this career mode with Gordon, if that's what you want to see. Option three is we start new. Now I'm familiar with the goalkeeper on FIFA 21. I've found some good settings. I think maybe starting from a low team and working our way up over a couple of seasons, not all that in one season, could be very interesting and much more entertaining. If that's what you think as well, then let me know. Or option four, we stay with Gordon on this and probably move anyway. But we start a new player career mode as a striker. and Maybe do a storyline or something along them lines in that. So let me know in the comments. I need your help. I want to know what you guys want to see. Also, remember to check out my Twitch stream schedule coming out very soon for that. Also, check out my Instagram. Links in the uh, description down below, along with what I use in my setup. If you did enjoy the episode, smash the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you're new. I've been a TSG. Goodbye.